Hi guys, today I will be teaching you how to make these DIY coasters. These are super easy to make and don't require a lot of material, so they're the perfect birthday or holiday gift or if you're just looking to let somebody know that you're thinking about them. The only thing you'll need to buy are these 4x4 tiles. I got these ones at Lowe's, but you can get them at any home improvement store. These particular ones were 79 cents each, but there were some that were a bit fancier that were a bit more expensive if you're looking to elevate the style a little bit. And then I also printed out some 4x4 images of favorite quotes and favorite photos with my loved ones. I got these off of Shutterfly for 15 cents each and had them delivered just to my apartment. And then you'll also need some Mod Podge and something to spread the Mod Podge around with so that you can glue the photo to the tile and then seal it at the end. Let's get started! So I started off just by trimming around the edges of the photo so that it fit onto the tile a little bit better. The 4x4 photos that I bought were just a little bit too big for the tiles that I purchased, so I just wanted to trim some of that excess off while still making sure to keep it a square. I definitely recommend using a ruler for this to make sure your lines are as even and as straight as possible, but I was just using supplies that I had lying around my house, so I used a coffee card to trace my lines and then use some scissors to cut off that extra trim and then once that was done I just applied a thin layer of Mod Podge to the top of the tile as a base coat. I spread it evenly and then laid the photo on top of that and set it aside to dry. After about 20 to 30 minutes the photo was dry enough so that it wasn't sliding around on top of the Mod Podge and I was re ready to put the top coat on. I started by using the q-tip to try to spread out the Mod Podge on top but as you can see it didn't work too well. It was pretty clumpy and then the cotton from the q-tip started to come off onto the coaster. So I eventually just went in with my finger which was honestly pretty messy but it worked pretty well actually and then I used an old towel to wipe off the excess so that it wasn't clumpy when it dried and once everything was wiped off and and clean I set it aside to dry overnight and this is the final result like I said I think these are the perfect gift especially around the holiday season because they're so affordable they're super easy to make and they're so easy to personalize to whoever you're giving them to I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial